My name is uh, Ivan Schuster. I am a uh, PhD in genetics and plant breeding. I work in uh, plant breeding uh, companies since 20 years. Uh, most part of the time working with uh, molecular breeding. I also work with uh, some conventional breeding, but uh, my major experience, uh, the ma most part of the time I work with uh, molecular breeding. I think uh, 21 century for plant breeding is a very exciting time. Our generation of plant breeders have, I think, uh, uh, privileged because we could explore uh, many new technologies and to have uh, new, new tools or new kits to improve the uh, performance of plant breeding and also to accelerate the genetic gain. Uh, and then I think uh, plant breeding is more scientific now than in the past and we work uh, more uh, in the genome and we can also see what happening, not just look for the uh, interaction of uh, environment and, and genotypes, but also knows uh, what genotype we are work, uh, looking for. And I think we already reached some good technologies, but uh, it's just the, the beginning, the, the future I think for plant breeding with the new uh, information, especially in, in the sequencing of the genomes, uh, will be bright. I think uh, we could uh, look for designing genotypes and follow the better genotypes uh, for better plants in the future. Yes, we used uh, so with uh, experience with uh, target genotype sequencing using these uh, agri-seq technologies. Uh, it was a great uh, improvement in our approach when we start to use genotyping by sequence. We have uh, much more information about the germoplasm we are working for, and uh, I, I think uh, we are more precise in our selection today than before. Uh, this is just, I think, the beginning that was said. Uh, These uh, new technologies and the new tools is a very important and very informative uh, uh, tools for the breeders. Uh, and then uh, just uh, having, not uh, just having field data, but also having genotypic data. And when you have uh, genotypic data associated with the field data, uh, we have much more rich information and we are much more precise making selections for the better plants. Uh, the new technologies uh, bring to us much more rich information and after using target genotyping by sequencing, we identify the better classification of our germplas and we fix it some misclassification and we understand how is our germplas is organized in the, the heterotic group correctly. And then we can use uh, in a much uh, more uh, efficient way the germplas and making better uh, crossing and also using the, the target GBS uh, by sequence to make predictions because we have lots of DNA information or lots of uh, sequence information and also we have so many, many uh, phenotypic data from the past and it was uh, used for making predictions or to correlate uh, genotype and phenotypes and we, can, we could uh, create much better hybrids using these technologies. Our experience with uh, Thermo Fisher was uh, very good. We started uh, to work with uh, genotyping by sequence and receive a very nice training in the beginning. Uh, the technical team was close to our team uh, every time until uh, the, the job is in a routine. And it was a key for our success. We learned very fast how to use the technology and our team uh, gained a lot of uh, experience uh, working close to the uh, Tammy Fisher team in the beginning and then we uh, put all of uh, this approach in our routine in a very fast time. 